start again. Basic tools, basic skills. It's what we need now. Really? And who is it that trapped those animals out there? The ones chasing you? If you're so smart, you can help me fix this. Just shut it. I'm trying to think. Oh, I feel terrible. You look terrible. It's not my fault. You're the one that got us into this mess. How are we going to get out? That's what I'm trying to figure out. And what I do? You were saying when you get out? You'll see. You can't keep us in here forever. Is that a fact? You're going to wish you'd never done this. Only by then, it'll be too late for wishing. It's easy to make threats from behind bars. It's not a threat. It's a promise. I'm warning you! I don't get it. It should work. I've got the special aerial and everything. Maybe if we took it outside. It wouldn't matter. Well, thanks, Einstein, but could you tell me how you reached that brilliant conclusion? The radio's fine. It's everything else that's wrong. Oh, very scientific. There's no one out there, Jack. That's why you can't hear anything. Oh, don't be stupid. This radio can pick up stations from all over the world. That's what I mean. You remember those last few days? The virus was everywhere. It spread too fast. Nowhere was safe. Nowhere. Think about it, Jack. If there are any adults in the world, what would they do? There's no television, no internet. The radio would be the first thing they'd use. Just like you're doing. They can't all have gone. Not all of them. We've got to keep trying. Jack, we're on our own. Jack, Del. The animals are awake. We need to decide what to do. Power and power! Power and power! For the last time, let us out of here! Well, it could be the last time if we just leave you in there till you starve. You? You couldn't hurt anyone if your life depended on it, nerd. Lex! 
He doesn't mean it. Really. So what are we going to do about them? Well, the first question is, what are we going to do about us? What? Well, they can't get in, but can we get out? There's another way up through the old sewer. Come on, Amber, let's just go. Del, we need somewhere to stay. I think it should be here. But I thought we were heading out to the country to find an old farm. That was the plan. Yeah, well, plans change. You and me, maybe we could have done it. But now there's all the others here. How do you think we're going to get them out of the city without running into the locos? But why do we have to look after them? Because they'd never survive without us, would they? This is the safest place for all of us, for now, if we stick together. <laughs> you mean, like, start our own tribe? Maybe. But what do we do about them? Well, easy. I just pull up the outside gate. They have to go back out on the street. Take the chances. We can't trust them. Can we trust them outside? What if they go to the locos and leave them here? So do we let them in? Or kick them out, boss? If we're going to stick together, we have to share what we have. I, um, haven't got much. Not much is better than nothing. Show us. That's it. That's all I've got. I don't believe you! You have ketchup! I love ketchup! <laughs> Thanks, Patsy. So, who's for beans, tinned meat, and ketchup? And we don't have to have them cold. Not practical, huh? I take it all back! This man has ketchup! I smell food. I'm starving, Lex. What are we gonna do? Of course, you have a choice. What? We've been talking about what to do. And we think the best thing would be to open the outside gate. Let you back out onto the streets. No, please. Lex, say something. What choice? Ah, it can listen. You're in charge of these kids? Maybe, for now. You sure you're in charge of them? So this choice? You can take your chances, outside with the locos. Or you can join us, but on our terms. We all share what we have, we work together, and maybe we stay safe. Maybe. Uh, Amber, how do we know we can trust them? The locos may have seen them. If that were true, we'd be happy to go back outside, wouldn't we? You're not very smart for a nerd. You will. Smart enough to trap you, Zero. You'll wish you'd never done that. Sounds like you've made your choice. Open the outside gate, Jack. No, wait. I want to stay. <laughs> Paul says you should shut up. All of you. He heard something. Listen. <laughs> there it was again. There was what? The kid's deaf. He feels things. Through the floor. Vibrations. Things you don't hear. What was that? Could be the locos. You still don't want to let us in? How do you get to the sewers? Uh, just through the Passaburo's middle door. Can anyone get in? They could, do I haven't had a chance to secure it. Right, I've got to find out what's going on. Jack, you look after the others. Del, you come with me. 
You won't last five minutes. Jack said it was around here. This must be it. Are you sure this is a good idea? No, but we're going in anyway. Sounds like rats. I can't see a thing down here. You want me to go in there with you? Good thing I bought my torch then. We could get lost down here. Lost only matters when you've got a hole now. Thanks for reminding me. Shh. Listen. Sounds like there's only one. Come on. Let's get back. What if I don't come back? The locusts could be on their way in right now. I saw them catch someone once. A weedy little kid. A bit like you, Jack. They tied him to a tree. Stop it! You're frightening the little ones. They should be frightened. And so should you! What are we gonna do, Jack? You've no choice. You open up, let us in, and maybe we'll help you. Maybe. I don't trust you. Trust? We're talking about survival here. This is your only chance. Do it! Do it, Jack. Jack. What's going on? Oh, I thought you weren't coming back. We offered to help. I'll bet. Did you find anything? Celine, take the kids to the cafe. Please, it's okay. Really. There was someone down there. Yeah. We lost him. Or her. We need to post a 24-hour guard down there. Make sure it's secure. Too late. They're here. Now, are you going to let us in? You accept our terms? For now, yes. For now wasn't the deal. You're heading for the streets, Jack. Okay, you win. Now let us in. Amber. Get on with it, you wimp! You accepted our terms. Did I? Maybe I lied. You and me, we're not finished yet. Ryan, come on. And me? Are you just gonna leave me here? It does stop you whining. Like you wanted to get out, now you're out. Go fix up your makeup or something. I wanted to give it back. Thanks. She missed it. Hey, you'll need this.
Secured the entrance. Shh. Too late. Listen. Do you think it's them? One way to find out. your weapons. My friend. That's one each, and don't spend it all at once. <laughs> I thought I told you to put a guard in the sewer. Who's this? Bray. He does tricks. I don't like tricks, Bray. Stop it, Lex. He just wants shelter. Can he speak for himself? We've already got one deaf one here. Bray, are you dumb? I don't shoot my mouth off. You call that dumb? This guy's been hanging around here spying on us. Did he tell you that? That's his trick. Why have you been spying on us? I told him. I had to be sure it was safe here. Safe for what? So you and your tribe can muscle in? I don't have a tribe. Unlucky for you. Because we have. That's enough. Lex. I haven't even started. We told you when we let you out of the cage. Our terms. So this guy just shows up, spies on us for a few days, and we welcome him with open arms. What if he's checking it out for the locos? I'm not. Says who? Ray does. And we believe him. You can't be too sure. Too right. We should put him in the cage until we know. He hasn't threatened us or tried to steal from us, Lex. Unlike you. I don't want anything from you. Just shelter for the night. You'll have noticed it's dangerous outside. Exactly. Which is why we shouldn't be taken in strays. Does that mean you and your friends are leaving too, Lex? We're all strays now. I say he goes. Well, you're in a minority of one. We've already decided. I told you, you're weak. 
All of you. Pathetic. Why couldn't you just stay awake, Jack? There's no point taking it out on Jack. We were wrong to believe the guy, that's all. I didn't. Remember? It was my food that he took. My food. After I trusted him. It belonged to all of us, Amber. Remember? You were supposed to be in charge. Not anymore. The terms have changed. It's my turn now. Mm. No more of your sweet face and your do-gooding. And didn't Bray look like such a nice boy? Got us a long way, didn't it, Amber? You getting your knickers in a twist about lover boy? Oh, Ryan, help me, help me. She's going to tear me apart. I don't know how you lot have lasted this long. You've all had more luck than you deserve. My bet is that Mr. Wonderful will be back. Only this time there'll be others. Now, if you want me to protect you, you do as I say. Let him come. I'm ready. Everybody, this is Trudy. I know what that is. That's a baby. That's right. We need a safe place to stay. We've been on the move for a week. She needs somewhere to have the baby. This is the safest place we've found. No. And you speak to the whole group, do you? Of course you can stay. There's plenty of room. She can say, can't she, Amber? Does she want to stay? I've got a name. Sorry. Do you want to stay, Trudy? Yes. Please? Look into the future, what do you see? I really need to know now, is there a place for me? Tell me where do we go from here Take me as you find me for what I am And when I make mistakes, please understand And as long as I know you're near There is nothing for me to fear Dream.